What's up, guys? Romeo Tango here, and we have story time. So today we're gonna to do a follow-up on the Vetter Holster that was sent out to me by no one other than Vetter Holster. Uh, I don't, I think I got this, it was around Thanksgiving. It was around Thanksgiving last year. Sent it out, said, hey, test this out. Let us know what you think, and do your worst with it. I uh, took it. It has gone through its paces. It has seen a lot of action and it is still in one piece. It has not broke. It has not lost in shape. Uh, none of the screws have loosened up. I have not locked tight anything. I took it out of the box. You saw it on the last video and I unboxed it and I've been running it like that ever since. And here it is in its glory, still doing its thing, still holding the gun in. Um, no issues, <laughs> none. Absolutely no issues. Um, I talked to my friends like, hey, check it out. This is what we got going on. Better host sent this out to us. They want us to test it out. So here you go. Took it out of my box, handed it to them. Like, Run it. Take it where you go. If you're going to range, take it to range. You're going to practice, practice with this. Give it a shot. So we've run it. We've run it. And I'm going to show you I'm not lying. And here, here is, here's my stance on... On guns like I don't trust anyone who tells me that uh, a gun they have or product they have is rock-solid if it looks like it's still brand new like don't put 200 rounds through a, a gun and tell me it's great don't put 500 rounds through a gun and tell me it's great put thousands of rounds through a gun and tell me it's great so I've done that I've done that for you so I'll even show you the visual evidence of how nasty this gun is. I've just been running it and running it and running it. I haven't cleaned it. Make sure it's in the camera. You can see it. It's dirty. It's grimy and still going. So I ran it. I ran this holster. This holster is gunked up inside as well. Uh, no issues. So I have two Glock 19 holsters. I have this one, which is my first, and I have a Safari Land that I bought, um, and I bastardized that. It's it's taken apart. I bastardized the Safari Land. It's taken apart. Um, I use it for different guns now. Like it's been sitting in a box. I think I gave it to a student <laughs> that I was training to run, <laughs> and uh, they ran it, and it, whatever. You know what I mean? Like whatever. So. Um, I didn't give him this one though. This no, it's not student worthy. <laughs> but anyway, anyway, uh, ran it, ran this thing to the ground. Still run it to the ground. No issues. Nothing's loosened. I've not locked tight the thing. Um, it's it's held its shape. It's been in the bottom of bags, bottom of boxes. It's been around. It's been abused. Like I don't treat anything I own firearm wise like a safe queen. Like I rotate, I pick two guns a month uh, for my safe, pistol, long gun. That's what I'm gonna run. And I run them that entire month. And I put rounds on them. And I don't clean them till the end of the month. I don't clean them at all. I just keep running them. If they stop during that, that time, then I'll clean them. If not, I run them. So if, you, if you're doing reviews and I'm looking at your pristine firearms, I don't trust you. That's, that's the point I make, but I digress. I digress. Anyway, back to the whole stuff. So, man, if you have not checked out Better Holster, check them out. They're coming out of Florida, fast turnaround, phenomenal customer service. Like, I cannot knock them on a customer service. They're great people, great customer service, and they do a good product. Like, look at the details in the holster. Look at the press work they've done. Look at how gorgeous this is. And, I mean, you can't lie. Like, they're... I, I even have holsters that don't have this kind of, or this level of detail in them. And this thing runs. It works flawlessly, no issues. I'll definitely be looking forward to getting something else from them. As soon as I decide on what gun I ne next I need a holster for, probably my Q5 or, ooh, you know what? My CZ Shadow 2 doesn't have a holster. I just have a universal holster that when I'm feeling lazy, don't feel like changing out holsters because I want to run a couple different guns, I'll put it on. It accepts just about anything, but no lights or anything. It has to be just the, the naked gun. So 
yeah, my oversight on this, and I'm knocking myself here because I'm an idiot. They asked me what I needed, what I wanted. And I was just, I had too much on my mind. I had a lot on my plate. And I was just like, yeah, just send me whatever top that you have, top line model you have. Send me that. Let me, let me test that. You're like, hey, you gonna run threaded barrels? Like, yeah, I'm gonna run threaded barrels. And th that's where I left it at. I didn't put in mind that I'd be running lights. And as you can see, <laughs> no, that is not an IR cover. That is just straight carbon. Like, I, it was to the point where I thought the battery was going dead. And the only reason why I found it was dirty because I went to change the battery and I saw the amount of carbon that was covering the, uh, the, um, the lens. Like, oh, that's why, it's just dim because the light can't shine through, it's fine. So that's my oversight. I should have asked for something that had, that was compensator ready or open-ended. So if I did have something on the end of the gun, I could shove it through there and also a light because I'm going to run lights. Like it, that was my oversight. So that's on me. Outside of that, phenomenal. I mean, they even offered and it, I'm the idiot that didn't pick up on it. Just too much on my mind at the time. But man, I recommend it. I recommend Vetter Holsters, great company, um, great product and great customer service. So you guys check them out. With the way YouTube is set up now, you can't really do too much ad placement, otherwise you'll get demonetized. So that's as much as I can go. Uh, as far as the set of rules go that I've read and been able to be privy to, as far as I can go, I can't do links, can't give websites. I can just tell you they have a website, Vetter Holst is in their name, check them out. I'm Romeo Tangle, guys. If you can't be quiet, be deadly.